last head cry, less than a mile ahead. Holy dick! Bodily burst into view. The white whale. Wondrous phenomenon of breaching. Rising with his utmost velocity from the farthest depths, the sperm whale booms his entire bulk into the air. The mountain, the dazzling foam, shows his place to the distance of seven miles. This breaching is his act of defiance. There she breaches! There, there she breaches! Aye, and breach your last to the sun, Moby Dick. Thy hour and thy harpoon are at hand. Down, down, all of me, but one man at the four. The boat stand by. As if to strike a quick terror into them. Moby Dick had turned and was now coming for the three crows. The white whale jammed himself into a furious beam with open jaws and lashing tail. A, a, a body battle on every side. White will so cross and entangled the slack of the three lines now fast to him that he warped in the boat and boat towards the planted irons in him. Caught and twisted. Corkscrewed in the mazes of the line. Loose of bones and lines. It's not the bristling bombs and void gang flashing. Drag the boats and stuff and flash forth this blue. Touching them together. Satisfied, Moby Dick pushed his pleated forehead through the ocean and trailing after him in the intertangled lines. Back on board. All eyes were upon Ahab. His ivory leg had been snapped off, leaving but a short, sharp splinter. But no bones broken, sir, I hope. <laughs> ah! But all splintered to pieces, Stubb! Do you see it? But even with the broken bone, old Ahab is untouched. Great God! But for one single instant, show thyself. Never, never will thy capture him, old man. In Jesus' name, no more of this. That's worse than the devil's madness. Two days chased. Twice stove to splinters. What more wouldst thou have? Shall we keep chasing the murderous fish till she swamps the last man? Shall we be dragged by her down to the bottom of the sea, to the infernal world? Oh, oh, impiety and blasphemy to hunt her more! Starbuck! Of late, I felt strangely moved to thee. Ever since that hour, we both saw, thou knowest what, in one another's eyes. But Ahab is forever Ahab, man. Fool, I am the fate's lieutenant. I act under orders. Look, thou underling, thou obeyest mine. Stand round me, man. You see an old man cut down to the stump. But ere I break, your hair may crack. <laughs> Believe you, man, in things called. Omens, aye. Holy Dick will rise once more, but only to spout his last. Do you feel brave, men? Brave! 